Hello, this is Will Dornan. We're going to tie a circus peanut. It's one of my favorite patterns on the Snake River. It's a simple Chernobyl ant. I think you'll have fun with it. The key to this pattern is the golden stone foam. I don't know what it is, but the fish love it. I build the body by rubbing little chunks of dubbing on. Always rub the dubbing on in the same direction. little something I do right here to keep the foam from spinning. I take a couple of wraps in front of the foam, then back in the middle of the foam, and it helps lock it down on the, on the shank of the hook so you don't get the twist on the foam when you're putting together these Chernobyl ants. I added a little bit of dubbing up in there, and I ran that over the thread to hide my, my thread wraps there that were holding the foam from spinning. When I finish this fly, and I didn't do it on this one. I put a little spot of glue right at the crux of where the legs and the body meet on all four of those little points. I didn't do it on this one just for time's sake, but I do it when I'm doing my own flies. Also notice I cut the legs and leave them fairly long, about the length of the of the body of the of the whole fly. It keeps them long and wiggly. Notice the legs angled down so they start wiggling the minute they hit the water. <laughs> <laughs> 